Good morning. We're Bill and Rebecca Hogg, and we have been members at the bridge since we moved back to Ruston after retirement six years ago. Today, we'll relight the candle of hope and the candle of peace. And today, we will write the candle of joy. This year has been especially hard due to Rebecca's advancing lung disease and has limited what we do and where we go. However, we have both experienced joy through deepening our relationship with God and His Word, sharing the gospel with strangers, encouraging friends, and especially being encouraged by them. Rebecca has experienced this through phone calls, Zoom sessions, and personal visits from friends. While I continue to meet with men <clears throat> through small groups, one-on-one -on -one disciple making, and connecting with neighbors, we have thankfully experienced joy through God providing these opportunities. We would now uh, like to read Matthew 2, 10 through 11. When they saw the star, they rejoiced exceedingly with great joy. And going into the house, they saw the child with Mary, his mother, and they fell down and worshiped him. We want to pray. God, our lives are filled with hints and echoes of the true joy that can only be found in you, the source and fulfillment of all good things. May the joy that was heralded by the angels when Jesus was born find echo in our hearts, and may our lives repeat that sounding joy to this side world. In Jesus' name, amen. 